The Dragon Boat Festival falls on the fifth day of the fifth lunar month. There are many different legends about the festival, but the most famous one is about Junyuan, a patriotic poet of the state of Chu during the Warring States period. Junyuan is said to have been loyal and patriotic his whole life. When he realized the decline of Chu was beyond recovery, his remorse, knowing he could no longer save it, grew stronger and stronger. On the fifth day of the fifth lunar month, he threw himself into the river and died for his beloved homeland. Locals living adjacent to the river rushed into their boats to search for him. They threw jiao shu, rice dumplings, and other food into the river. To keep fish and turtles from devouring Chu Yuan's body. Later, to commemorate this patriotic poet, the customs of holding dragon boat races and throwing jiao shu into the river on the fifth day of the fifth lunar month were passed down, giving rise to the name Dragon Boat Festival. In September 2009. The Dragon Boat Festival became China's first festival to be selected with the world's intangible cultural heritage. Most Chinese festivals are related to specific foods, and the Dragon Boat Festival is no exception. The zongzi is an indispensable food for the Dragon Boat Festival. In the past, every family would soak glutinous rice, prepare reed leaves for wrapping. Wrap the rice around sweet fillings such as jujube and bean paste, or savory ones like fresh meat or ham, and tie them up into pyramidal shapes. Zongzi, which is very popular in China, are now mass-produced on the production line. Many people choose to buy ready-to-meet products. Wu Fangzhai, one of China's largest zongzi producers, ships out more than three million pieces a day during the Dragon Boat Festival, and their annual production of zongzi exceeds 400 million pieces. In Junyuan's hometown, Zigui County of Central China's Hubei Province, a grand dragon boat race is held every year during the Dragon Boat Festival. This folk activity has been passed down from generation to generation, dating back more than 2,000 years. Today, China's dragon boat racing has developed from a local activity into a grand sports event, and even became an international sporting event. There are more than 85 countries and regions in the world that hold dragon boat races annually. The Boston Dragon Boat Festival has been held for 14 years. And the Toronto International Dragon Boat Festival has witnessed more than 30 years of races. China's dragon boats have rode to the world. After breaking some sweat from a dragon boat race, the next festival calls for Romans. The traditional Chinese Valentine's Day or Qingxi. Let us look forward to the arrival of love.